Bismillahirrahmanirrahim Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh to you all In today's video, we are going to talk about uh, uh, Gears uh, In general gears uh, This video is taken from the book Shigli Mechanical Engineering Design So uh, This is the first video on gears we are, uh, Now I am going to tell about layout from the gear This, this is the layout uh, uh, Chapter outline for the gear uh, you can see if you have the book with you, this is uh, the topic and all the pages that refer to the topic. Uh, so, we will start with type of gear, nomenclature, conjugate action, involved properties, fundamentals, contact ratio, interference, forming of gear teeth, straight bevel gears, parallel helical gears, worm gears, tooth system, gear trains, force analysis, uh, spur gearing, force analysis, bevel gearing, Force analysis, helical gearing, and force analysis on worm gearing. So, uh, so this chapter address gear geometry, kinematic relations, force transmit by the four principal types of gear, a spur, helical, bevel, and worm gears. The forces transmit between meshing gears supply torsional moments to shaft for motion and power transmission and create forces and moment that affect the shaft and its bearing. This is what uh, we are talking about here. I'm sure you are familiar with gear uh, because you see, you have seen gear in uh, in many places, uh, especially uh, toys. Uh, if you, uh, uh, why I mention toys because uh, if you take any kind of toys uh, like car toys. Uh, you can easily dismantle the toys and you can see the gear inside the toy uh, uh, for uh, for other technical gears that you encounter maybe you have uh, it, it is uh, enclosed in a casing meaning that uh, you have to open the casing and then you can only that you can see the gear uh, like for example Helical gear, bevel gear, worm gear, uh, and and much more. I'm sure uh, throughout your life you have seen many kind of gears, uh, whether it is a toy, whether it is a part of the machinery and everything. Uh, uh, this chapter is relatively straightforward. The challenges in this chapter is to do calculation, uh, to to do to do some calculation on it. Uh, uh, you can see when it involves uh, some mathematics, okay. Uh, so you uh, it involves some mathematics and also mathematics that are related to x and y and z axis. Maybe it will be difficult to some of you. Uh, maybe it is easy to some of, for some of you. So. Uh, when the when the uh, chapter came, we will we will try uh, our best to learn about how to calculate for the gear. Okay, so uh, okay, so this is picture I taken from Google Images about gear. We will learn later on what is the uh, nomenclature, how to calculate gear. Uh, kind of gear that you should use and everything that's all for this video today we see you in the next video on type of gears thank you very much